Give stuff away. Come on, man. Let me hit the ring and just chill. Yeah, you ready? Give stuff away. Come on, man. Give stuff away. What's the craziest thing a fan has ever given you? Because you've got some diehard fans. Where exactly is this going to air? It's online. It's all online. Think of the children. Talking to these guests and things are going on and all of a sudden something whizzes by my head and I'm thinking, wow, somebody just threw something like right at me yeah. and it lands and I turn around and the crowd goes crazy and I look over there and there is a beautiful purple laced bra. A beautiful bra. I mean, like a, like an expensive. So, like, bra. yeah. Did you keep it? I mean, you know, like, so what a terrible thing I to waste. So I go down to pick the bra with my hands, and I'm thinking, I don't want to get caught with this in my hands. I'm gonna go with some tongs. I pick up some tongs. I said, Would whoever threw this like this back? Or matter of fact, I'll trade you. I'm gonna keep this, and I'll give you a knife. And all of a sudden, this 85 year old woman stands up, and she's and only standing up to grab her, I assume, granddaughter, and you, you know, who's so about 20, says. who's about 25 years old, uh, and, and they come walking up, and both of them were just giggling away, and I gave them, I think, both a knife. That's amazing. Uh, but yeah, I would say that the purple bra is probably one of the craziest right. things. That's a good one. And so, question number two: You had to be on another reality show that required you to have a different talent. What show would you go on? Another reality show that had a different talent. Yeah, like it can't just be like, you know, real house husband. Yeah. No, I would house. be uh, juggling with the stars. People in America's Got Talent. No, juggling. it's juggling with the stars. There is that's no, all, there's that's, a real show, juggling with the stars. No, you didn't say it had to be a real show. Oh. I mean, a real I, show. No, 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 Isn't no. Isn't it crazy though no, that I thought that juggling. could be a real show? <laughs> juggling with the stars. Um, so, question number three, would you shave and dye your hair for a good cause? Oh, absolutely, absolutely. Now, a matter of fact, I was even telling, uh, I was telling one of my agents. I said, you know, it's so funny if see people that have their iconic look, and then people say, well, would you, you know, would you shave yeah. it for, uh, for a charity? Absolutely. For for a hundred dollars for a charity? Right, absolutely no. not. <laughs> no, there'd have to be some, there'd have to be some coin involved in it. Away. Give stuff away. So, question number four. You know the game, Chuck, Screw or Mary? We're gonna say screw here. Give you know the game. What? Yeah, you know that game. So you have diners, drive-ins, and dives. Yes. Which one would you chuck? Which one would you just make sweet love to? And which one would you marry and keep forever? You've never heard of this game? I've never heard of this game, but it's really perverted that I'm going to do it with a diner, a drive-in, or a dive. That's a lot of building. Um, <laughs> I'm glad I've taught you about a immensely popular game. Well, I mean, that, you, you, you're making it a weird thing. I mean, getting rid of one of them was is to, completely against my my belief because they all they all fit. But, That's the game. Um, I, I would say that I would have to uh, I would have to. I think diners. I'd probably have to, to. That would have to be the chuck, and not because I don't love them. I think they're incredible restaurants, and but I was never brought up with them. So still to this day, I wonder. Like when we'll drive by a diner, I'm like. How did they diner? How did they pick that name for a diner? You go to some places, you'll see a diner, and you're like, ah, oh, the Everetti Diner. I get it, it's a diner. Right. So that would be the only one. But that's like, and then so which one is like a fling, and then which one is your true love? I, mean, I would say my my fling would be uh, would be the drive-ins, right. and my my uh, true love my true love would be the dives. Yeah, what yes. do you think? I love, that. How, I love that. See, you made it fling. You made it a lot I, more I tried PG. To make it nice, you made it a lot more PG. Give yeah. stuff away. And so question number five goes with that. Oh is boy, there, now what is it? No, this is easier, this is easier. Is there a secret, like, elitist food that you secretly love? Like, are you like really, like at night, like, oh, I really want foie gras right now? Elitist food, so you're talking about the, the, the fancy food of the world yeah. type type thing. Oh, I'm I'm a junkie. I don't, it, there's not, people I think misinterpret it all the time. They see the tattoos and the and the hot rod and the, and the show and they go, oh, this guy loves chili dogs and hamburgers. And I mean, I enjoy that side of it, but I'm, I'm believe it or not, I'm, I eat more vegetables than you'd probably ever imagine. I'm a huge vegetable fan, big kale, Brussels sprouts. Um, all the green veggies that you would not expect right. me to eat. But I mean, is there something like I love, oh, like Italian prosciutto? If you're gonna bury me, prosciutto. If, if I was gonna be buried alive in, in something, in a, in, if I was gonna be buried alive in this item, is that what you wanna say? Yeah. Uh, truffles. 
Not yeah. chocolate truffles, no. real truffles. Yeah. Okay, not black truffles, white, white truffles. truffles. And I mean, good night, all right? Game over. You could well, also you could also stuff wishes. a leg of prosciutto <laughs> under this arm, and you could also <laughs> give me some bone marrow over here um, in any of the salumis, you know, any of the Italian coca. I mean, this list could go on and on, but it would have to be, I'm a, I'm a truffle junkie. Wonderful. Well, thank you so much for taking the time, answering <laughs> all our questions. Crazy question. Congratulations good question. on the book. I think all I think differently now about my three, about my diners, my drivers and diners. I hope that will stay with you. I have to I have to call diners and apologize. I feel so bad. Oh well. Thank you so much. My pleasure. My pleasure.